What is going on, guys and girls and puppies? I haven't seen like a puppy like out for a walk in like a few days. Now, I want to see the puppy. Because I like puppies. And then we go, oh, you guys are puppy. And then you guys make fun of me. They're like, oh, there's a puppy. Oh, you guys are puppy. Oh, it's your puppy. And yeah, I get made fun of for it. I don't care. It's your puppy. It's worth it. But I haven't seen a puppy. And it upsets me. I legitimately haven't seen a puppy in a few days. Like, I haven't, it, it depresses me. I want to see a puppy. <laughs> I don't even know how I went off on that tangent. It just opened itself up on me. And I was like, I'm going to talk about puppies. Because I miss them. So I don't know if it's hot or cold out. Or what to have you. But, yeah. Oh, I forgot my badge for work. And that, my, that upset me. Thoroughly. Because I need that for work. And I'm like, no. I must... Because I need to get it to get in. So I already texted a few of my buddies. I was like, hey, I'm on my way to See, because I would have gone back for it. But by the time I realized that, I was already walking for half an hour. And yeah, then I was like, well, I can't go back and get it now or else I'll be late for work. So it was either be late for work. Or not have a badge. <sighs> and so I say before my day off. So my day's off. Day off. Day offs. So one word. I think it's two. I don't know. I'm tired. I have a cough. Ah. Uh, but yeah. So. By the way, I'm working on a version of. Not sorry for being me. That'll be on iTunes. Hopefully. If not, then I guess you guys will be getting it for free. If you want it. So that should be coming up decently soon. Um, I don't know. I kind of need a few things. Before I can do it. Like I want to get like a full band. and I really don't want to do all the instruments on my own. Because, you know, it's just better... So, uh, guys, watch Not Sorry For Being Me, the song one, not the vlog. And... I don't know, like... Add some drums or something. Add something. Upload it as... Um... What's the word? As a... Video response to either not sorry for being me or to this vlog and who knows you might end up in the final version in which case I would give full credit ah oh, man it's hot out it was cold earlier and I have another sweater on well no the other sweater's in my backpack I just took it off because it's getting hot out yeah, it's not, like, it's not bad. And I'm wearing a long sleeve shirt. And I'm going to regret that. Ah, okay, so yeah, guys. Well, no, more, more so girls. Girls. I got a question. Because there's something that you girls do that bugs me more than anything else. You know, I've been like two girls. I've been, you know, everything off the list. But there's this one thing that bugs me the most. When 90% of you will do the whole, oh, I'm fat, oh, I'm ugly, oh, I'm this or I'm that, and putting yourself down. Why? That's what I want to know. Because, like, it honestly bugs me. Like, if I'm sitting there talking to you, you're like, oh my god, I'm so fat. 
and we were hanging out the other day and you were perfectly skinny and fit then not skinny skinny like not like model skinny because that's disgusting i mean i do have a few friends that are like model skinny and i'm like you need to eat food don't care what you eat just food I'm like okay and they eat a pea and i'm like no anyway one of my perfectly healthy friends they're like look that's like me saying i'm fat okay I'm just saying. I am a fat guys. Wish that is perfectly flat. And chiseled. It's not chiseled. I haven't done crunches in months. Ah, I need to start working out. I'm going, I believe tomorrow I'm working out with a friend. I think we're just doing a rundle. I don't know if I'm excited. I said, go ahead, let's go for a run. Now I'm like, oh, exercise. I don't know. Anyway, I'm not done. Okay. Stay on topic. Okay. Um, yeah, so, and I don't get it. Like, why do you, you know, if you weigh like 120 pounds and you're skinny and you're fit, and when people look at you, they go, dad ass. Why do you go, oh my god, I'm so fat? Like, my stomach is so big. I'm like, girl, you do not want to see me shirtless. I have a gut, surprisingly. I know. Flat, I take that off and it's just... It's like freaking Homer. You guys, I don't know. I'm getting chubby. Shut up. But I can honestly say that. I'm not saying I am chubby. I'm not, I'm not like, oh no, I'm... I'm fat when I'm clearly not. I'm saying I'm putting on a few pounds. Not a lot, a few. I think I'm like 165 now? Ish? I know. Do I look like I weigh over 100 pounds? Like, God. Not really, but I do. Just take my word. I'm. I look skinny, but I'm not. My still weighs more than fat. Anyway, no. Okay. Okay, that's it. Take, guys. Well, you'll say, "Oh man, I'm fat. I need to work out." When they're fat and need to work out. When guys, when we put ourselves down, we're generally being completely truthful and using fact. Girls are like. Oh, my thighs jiggle. Then, I don't know, walk. And your thighs don't jiggle. They, yeah, they jiggle when you smack it. That's due to, I believe it's Newton's third law? Where, uh, if I can remember exactly what it is, in which it is, uh, The one about putting force upon something, and then the effect is that it will have an equal or opposite force. It's like when two objects make contact, it will create an equal or opposite force against the other. So you punch a wall, you hurt your hand. It's, it's physics. And common sense. <laughs> but yeah, so you hit your thigh, your thigh will jiggle. Because I'm sorry, but unless you're a fucking bodybuilder, you're gonna have some fat. Sorry, but it's gonna happen. And okay, I, I played football for several years. I played rugby for several years. I'm athletic. I hit my thighs, my thighs jiggle. And I was a wide receiver in football and a winger in rugby. I ran a lot. The strength behind my legs is insane. Yet my thighs still jiggle. I'm just saying. Stop putting yourself down is really what I'm saying there. That there is no need 
to put yourself down like that because quite frankly there's no fact behind it I don't know so I had to go off on a change like that guys it's just something that's been bugging me and I wanted to get it out because quite frankly it I don't get it so girls leave a comment about why you do that down there girls I almost got punched there it was a fucking PT cruiser FedEx is stopping. Is it gonna give me a drive? If so, can we go back to my house and get my back? Oh, he was just slowing down. Well, that sucks. Okay, uh, yeah, so what else do I want to talk about? Growing pains? I have them. I think I already talked about that. Have I already talked about that? I don't know. I have growing pains and it hurts, but I'm a midget, so I'm allowing it because I need to grow. So I'm wearing several hundred dollar shoes and I'm walking that. Yeah, several hundred dollar shoes and I'm walking from actually an ex-girlfriend of mine. Who just so happened to have a lot of money. Bought me. These shoes. Around Christmas, it was a Christmas present. I was like... I don't remember what I gave her. But it sucked compared to several hundred... And she gave me a lot. I don't even want to know how much she spent on my entire Christmas present. But it was several hundred dollars. For my shoes alone. Then it was like shirts and, God, anyway, not this shirt though. All in all, honestly, I bought this shirt at Value Village. It cost me two bucks. And look how awesome it is. And like I washed it like 10 times before I wore it. I don't even do like doing laundry. So that's impressive. No, it's not that I don't like doing laundry. As I don't like having to pay to do laundry. That's where that comes in. <sighs> so I'm gonna get going. Because I still have a long way to talk. And I redid this vlog. So people have been waiting for me to text them back for like half an hour. And they're like, why is he not responding? He's walking to work. Why? Even though they know if I'm walking to work and not answering, it's one of two things. It's raining or I'm vlogging. Anyway, guys. Uh, yeah, so in the bottom, leave a comment about why people subject themselves to degrading themselves or growing pains. The most expensive present you have ever gotten. Yeah, so let's leave, leave a comment right down there. Get a shout out. And I'll try to remember your name. I'll write it down in my iPhone and I'll look at it. Or I'll just start putting the shout out like in a, an annotation below. Ah, Alright guys. Thanks for watching. I give you the thumbs up and I'm holding coffee, so peace out. Keep on rocking.